That spirit, I think um, I wanted to share about a little bit about what the boy, Boycott, Divestment and Sanctions campaign is all about um, because I think it's really important um, to, to publicize this campaign in particular. This is a campaign that's being called by Palestinian civil society. Uh, the media likes to, to paint all of people living in Gaza and the West Bank as terrorists. Um, and I think we, should, we, we have to shatter that myth. Um, and um, I want to read uh, the statement that's been put out by the international BDS campaign. Inspired by the struggle of South Africans against apartheid and in the spirit of international solidarity, moral consistency, and resistance to injustice and oppression, we call upon international civil society organizations and people of conscience all over the world to impose <coughs> broad boycotts and implement divestment initiatives against Israel similar to those applied to South Africa in the apartheid era. These nonviolent punitive measures should be maintained until Israel meets its obligation to recognize the Palestinian people's inalienable right to self-determination and fully complies with the precepts of international law by one, ending its occupation and colonization of all Arab lands and dismantling the wall. Recognizing the fundamental rights of the Arab Palestinian citizens of Israel to full equality. Yeah. and respecting, protecting, and promoting the rights of Palestinian refugees to return to their homes and properties as stipulated in UN Resolution 194. Right. I think this is, a, this is a key part of building a sustained campaign, the only kind of campaign that's going to actually bring an end to Israel's assaults, an end to Israel's attacks. As Brian mentioned, we were out here in 2009, and sadly we have to be out here again. And we do not want to be out here responding to this to these tragedies year after year. And in order to do that, we have to build an, a broad-based international campaign that holds Israel accountable, that holds this administration here in the United States accountable for funding the slaughter in Israel, in, in Palestine. That is the only way that we're actually gonna build solidarity. Um, and I think, um, I think this, is, this is a good start. Uh, I wanna encourage everybody to um, sign up uh, there's a Students for Justice uh, Pal in Justice in Palestine chapter at RIT. Um, there's a petition. Uh, it's a sign-up sheet for uh, that that has the statement for BDS. Um, get your name and number on this list, and uh, uh, students at RIT will be organizing uh, in, in the near future. Hey Obama, we want change in Gaza. 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 Hey Obama. We want change in Gaza. Hey Obama, 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 the river. We want change in Gaza. From the river to the sea, Palestine will be free. From the river to the sea, Palestine will be free. From the river to the sea, Palestine will be free. From the river to the sea, Palestine will be free. From the river to the sea, Palestine will be free. From the river to the sea, Palestine will be free. From the river to the sea, Palestine will be free. From the river to the sea, Palestine will be free. From the river to the sea, Palestine will be free. From the river to the sea, Palestine will be free. From the river to the sea, Palestine will be free. From